Baglan is one of the 34 provinces of Afghanistan. It is in the north of the country. As of 2020, the province has a population of about 1,014,634. Its capital is Puli Khumri, but its name comes from the other major town in the province. Baglan, the ruins of a Zoroastrian fire temple, the Surkh Kotal, are located in Baglan. The lead nation of the local provincial reconstruction team was Hungary, which operated from 2006 to 2015. The name Baglan is derived from Bagalango or image temple, inscribed on the temple of Surkh Kotal during the reign of the Kushan Emperor. Kanishkar in the early 2nd century CE. The Chinese Buddhist monk Shanzang traveled through Baglan in the mid 7th century CE and referred to it as the Kingdom of Fokia Lang. In the 13th century CE, a permanent garrison of Mongol troops was quartered in the Kunduz Baglan area and in 1253 fell under the jurisdiction of Sali Noyan Tatar, appointed there by Monke Khan. Sali Noyan's position was later inherited by his son Uladu and grandson Bakhtat. These Turko-Mongol garrison troops formed the Karaunas faction and by the 14th century had allied with the Chaghatate Khanate. Under the rule of Temur the Karaunas were given to Cheku Barlas and then to his son Jahan Shah. Forbes Mans notes that these Kunduz Baglan forces appear to have remained cohesive and influential throughout the Timurad period though under different leaders and different names. Up until the Uzbek invasion, by the Islamic year 900, the area was noted in the Baburnama as ruled by Akip Chak Emir. In the mid-20th century, as Afghanistan became the target of international development from both the Western and Soviet world, agricultural industrial projects were initiated in Baglan. These included factories for the production of sugar from sugar beets and for vegetable oil. Czech expertise also figured heavily into the development of Buglan's coal mining industry. Centered at Buglan's Karkar Valley, the only coal mine in Afghanistan to remain operational up through 1992. The modern Buglan province was created out of the former Katargan province in 1964. During the Soviet-Afghan War, the Soviets in 1982 established the Kayan military zone in southern Buglan. The area was defended by 10,000 Ismaili militiamen, increasing to 18,000 by 1992, who sided with the Soviets due to differences with the Islamist opposition. Afghan Ismailis overall were inclined to support the communists, though a local Ismaili leader, Syed Mancher, lead a partisan movement against the communists until Ismaili leader Syed Mansa Nadiri accepted Soviet support. Large portions of Buglan and neighboring Samangan province were under the sway of the Soviet-aligned Nadiri clan. The hereditary Ismaili Syeds of Kayan, under their jurisdiction, was largely quiet and societally functional throughout the 1980s, with hospitals, schools, and administrative services, funded by the communist central government. Despite the Nadiri's alliance with the communists, they also maintained positive relations with the Mujahideen as well permitting them to move through the area provided they refrained from attacks. One of the Soviet's three primary bases in Afghanistan, Kiligai, was located in Buglan province and served as the largest military supply and armory center of the Soviet troops in Afghanistan. As the 2001 Afghan war commenced, Ismaili leader Syed Mansur Nadiri attempted to retake Buglan from the Taliban. Nadiri was aligned with Uzbek warlord Abdul Rashid Dostum and his Jambeshe Mili party. And the competing Taik-dominated jamiat e islami party was also keen to seize control of Baglan. As Taliban power eroded, the jamiat were able to seize the capital of Pulai Khumri before Nadiri, who despite his strong backing among the Afghan Ismailis and Shia Hazaras, was unable to rally enough supporters to control the province. Nadiri failed to retake the capital in 2001 and 2003. In the latter event he negotiated a power-sharing agreement with the dominant Andarabi militias and made the Ismaili bastion of the Kayan Valley his base. On 13 June 2012, two earthquakes hit Afghanistan and there was a major landslide in Burka district of Buglan province. The village of Sai Hazara was buried under up to 30 meters of rock. 
killing an estimated 71 people. On April 13, 2021 an official in Baglan province said on the 13th that a group of Taliban militants attacked a checkpoint in the province that day and killed six security personnel. So the town of Puli Khumri serves as the capital of the province. All law enforcement activities throughout the province are handled by the Afghan National Police. The provincial police chief represents the Ministry of the Interior in Kabul. The ANP is backed by other Afghan national security forces, including the NATO-led forces. Taj Muhammad Jahid has been the governor of the province since July 2020. According to Naval Postgraduate School estimates, tykes make